Good morning. I'm still in the uh, West Sumatran city of uh, Padang where the recovery effort is fully underway. Standing outside the Abachung Hotel where the, uh, the diggers and the earth movers are taking a bit of a break at the moment. They've really uh, stepped up their uh, removal of the rubble, although there are still, they believe, 24 bodies uh, trapped behind me. There are some signs of improvement in the city. There are more lights on at night, although it'll be some time before uh, people are really, truly back on their feet. The, uh, a 22-strong army uh, engineering unit uh, arrived a short time ago. They are the guys with the water purification equipment and uh, as soon as sun comes up they'll be heading out to provide clean drinking water to some of the 75,000 people here that they've identified that, that don't have drinking water. Also at first light a 22-strong army medical team will be heading out to an outer village where uh, they believe uh, people are in need of assistance. They'll be setting up a field hospital which will have uh, x-ray facilities as well as a small hospital ward. The Department of Foreign Affairs still believes there are 17 Australians unaccounted for in the region here, although they've had no reports of injuries or deaths among Australians. So we may be lucky there where we find out that no Australians were caught up in uh, Wednesday's quake. The uh, urban rescue, search and urban rescue guys from Queensland they are still in preparations uh, to pack up and leave or put wheels up, so to speak. But the difficulty for them is actually getting out of here and cleaning their equipment to fit in with Australian custom and quarantine guidelines. Now, in another sign, a sign that the city is getting back on its feet, university students went back to school yesterday, although it will be some time for other uh, school kids and, and like to, uh, before they go back to school because authorities uh, still haven't checked their buildings. So while there are small improvements, still, uh, the city still has a long way to go before they, uh, they really get back to a normal way of life. That's all from here. It's back to you. Cool.